Massacre night at Molyneux. But not yet. The great crowd saw Wolves, lighter jerseys, attack straight from the kickoff against Barcelona. There was an early chance for inside right Broadbent, but goalkeeper Antonio Ramelitz wasn't severely tested. It was the second leg of the European Cup quarter-final, and as Wolves had never before lost on their home ground to a foreign side, they expected the even Super Bowl players of Barcelona would go away humbled. What a hope. The early bombardment of the Wolves' goal was the shape of things to come. Centre forward Martinez sent the ball to Sandor Coxis. Goal to Barcelona. Bloom at Molyneux. But Wolves were undaunted. Down at the other end, Ramelets and a slice of luck kept the Barcelona net clear. Yes, indeed, play up the Wolves. And for a short time, play up they did. And centre forward Murray equalised. It was near the interval now. The score won all, Wolves back in the game. But the ball went to Martinez, from him to Coxis, and then in the net like a flash. So Barcelona began the second half leading 2-1. If these international stars were going to be beaten, sharpshooter Broadbent knew it was now or never. But the great Ramelets dived to the occasion. Is there any reason why top stars can't play soccer with some comic touches? Martinez thinks, why not? Poor Harris. Happily for Wolves, no goal this time. By now, it was obvious that Wolves hadn't a hope of getting any nearer that European Cup. Coxis headed Barcelona's third goal. What a night for Coxis. That amazing Hungarian got his fourth goal. And Mason scored Wolves' second one. Now a high pass found outside left Villaverde. He quickly had it under control, and there it was, Barcelona's goal number five. Hard luck, Wolves. Congratulations, Barcelona.